These are my five variation of foundation exercise that you should use every single time you hit a navy chest press workout. The bench press is one of the strength movement that allows you to build upper body strength in the horizontal push. Today we're gonna do a little bit of variation using the eccentric isometric technique. So what I want you to do, I want you to set up as a strength position in the bench, so slightly hunch, back, glutes engaged, feet pushed down on the ground, shoulder down and locked. I'm gonna grab the bar, breathing, eight seconds to go down. And hold, one, two, squeeze. And again. Hold, and go. This allows you to increase scapular position, chest activation throughout the movement, stabilizing your shoulder and making sure that your pec muscle doing most of the work to hold, maintain position and push away. Second exercise, incline dumbbell chest presses. We're gonna work on one and a quarter rep and we're gonna have a negative phase of four seconds. Of course, as a setup, you wanna have your slightly hunched position and shoulder locked down as if you do bench press. Breathe in, push away, locked, and you go for one, two, three, four, quarter, and push. Go again. One, two, three, four, quarter, and push. This allows you to stretch your pec muscle to work all the way down and reach a full stretch position, stabilize your scapula and up, activate your upper pec a little bit more on the way up. Exercise number three, dumbbell squeezy chest presses. In this variation, we're gonna work on a 10 repetition. We're gonna work on a five slow, two to three second down tempo and five reps with a normal one to one speed. Same position, slightly hunch back position, short down, breathing brace. We're gonna go slow. One, two, one, two, three, go. Gonna do five slow reps. It should be about there. And then normal speed. This allows you to actually get your mid part of your pack engaged as hard as you actually can, pushing your elbows in as much as you're pushing your dumbbells away from you. So really focus on getting your elbows, getting close together and slowly back there. Exercise number four, we're gonna use the rings and we're gonna do chest dips. The variation we're gonna use on is just a simple two second hold in the bottom position. So we can do body weight, knees off the ground, and hold. One, two, go. One, two, go. These are quite a difficult movement. So we're gonna use an assisted bend. I'm gonna show you how to set it up. You can simply go bend around the ring, bend to the other side. We're gonna step on with knees making sure that we have a solid grip. Once we're there, dip down, one, two, push. One, two, push. And rest. This allows you to fully stretch your pack, use your tricep in a pushing motion and use your lower part of your pack. Exercise number five. This is my favorite chest shoulder exercise. We're gonna use the dumbbells. We're gonna use a bench incline at 60 to 80 degrees. So it's a fairly upright. We're gonna work on Arnold shoulder presses. We're gonna work down with a slightly hunch back position to make sure we actually engage the upper part of the chest. Palm facing the face of the start off to out rotating and coming back up. 
gonna work on steady, two seconds down, two seconds up to fully maintain contraction. Ready? Chest it goes out. Brace. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. And down. If you want to know exactly how many sets repetition I use for every single exercise, just comment below, like the video, and let me know what you think.